How does a 25% defense reduction do more damage than a 30% boost? And how does this affect your team building? Well, Chiyu and Chien Pao have unique abilities that reduce the defensive stats of all other Pokémon by 25%. The item Life Orb amplifies damage by 30%. Intuitively, it seems like Life Orb should do more damage because 30% is higher than 25%, right? Right? Well, not quite. Life Orb is simple. A 30% damage boost is a 30% damage boost, straight up. But Sword and Beads of Rune aren't a direct boost of 25%, since what they actually do is reduce defensive stats by one quarter. This leaves the target's defensive stat at three quarters of its initial value. And since the damage formula divides by the target's defensive stat, we can flip three quarters to get the true multiplier, four thirds. We can subtract one from four thirds to get the rune ability damage boost, one third, or about 33.3%. And this 33.3% boost is indeed higher than the 30% from Life Orb. You can use the damage calculator to easily verify what I've told you. Swords and Beads of Rune provide a higher damage boost than Life Orb or Booster Energy do. So, how can you use this information? Don't assume that just because your Pokémon can survive a Life Orb or Protosynthesis attack, that it can survive the same attack boosted by Sword or Beads of Ruin. I made this mistake myself, and it almost cost me a match at a local tournament, so afterward I adjusted my EV spreads to make sure this isn't a problem in the future. We have a question for you, and would appreciate your input to help shape our future videos. Would you be interested in more videos covering details of in-game mechanics similar to this one? Let us know in the comments, and we'll base our future plans on your feedback. And thank you for watching! I'm Josh with Sly and Pine VGC, and we wish you a wonderful month.